an English perfumer who has created a magnificent fougere fragrance and the notes in it are bergamot, mandarin, lavender, have I memorized it yet? Coriander, cardamom, pepper, and in the, the no. Hello everyone, welcome back to all of you out there in the Smelly Army. So I had to come on camera very briefly tonight to say thank you to everybody out there who has given their support to Gravitas Pour On, my upcoming release from the house of Norton and Wilson. We launched our Kickstarter campaign on Friday evening. You can go and check it out, there's a link in the description below. And we had a target, in order to make the fragrance happen, we had to hit a target of uh, 10,000 pounds to make this viable, to produce it. We've just got a very small amount of actual real juice here. This is what the bottle's gonna look like, the label's something like this, the lid will be like this. And uh, yeah, but this is just mock-up juice in here. We need to get that funding in to produce the fragrance by fantastic perfumer John Stephen from the Cotswold Perfumery in the UK. And he's also made very famous fragrances for Bodicea, the Victorious, and Check and Speak amongst other people. So the, the, we're very excited about the project. When we launched it on Friday, we, we didn't know if we would even, you know, how much of a challenge it might be, we thought, to hit the target of £10,000, which would equate to around about 130 something bottles sold. But we've smashed through it at the moment. We're already on £15,000, so it's definitely happening. And we are extremely grateful to everyone who has pledged their support. It, it means the world to me that you've done this so thank you so much another really exciting thing that happened today is uh, we're on the front page today on fragrantica the what the foremost fragrance review and fragrance discussion website in the world we've got an article by miguel matos one of the best online fragrance writers out there and a man who also i should mention does have his own fragrance line now miguel matos perfumes one of which germaine I have here and these are really high art fragrances. I will put a link to his uh, website for that fragrance brand because they, they are well worth checking out if you love fragrances as much as he does as, and as I do. And he's written a very kind article about the fragrance and about the early success of the Kickstarter campaign. So go and check that out. It's big news for Mr. Smelly to be on Fragrantica. Who would have thought it? But it's, it's you know, as much as anything I've done, it's thanks to you there, the people who watch the videos, the people, even if you haven't pledged support, just who voiced support, that's helped me to carry on and inspired me and made me think, yes, I'll keep going with this, with the channel and with this fragrance release. And of course, the people who've actually pledged, thank you so much. Still plenty of time to get your bottle order in up until the 2nd of December. The bottle is just priced for 100 mil at 75 pounds. You can make jokes about, oh, are you gonna treble the price like Jeremy Fragrance after that? Well, no, but it, it, usually when you do a Kickstarter, you're offering a special offer price. So it, you know, if things are successful, once we get our own online uh, website where we can sell it, it probably will go up a little bit in price. So it would be great to get your order in before that happens probably. And also remember, I, we, you will be one of the people who bought one of the original batch of bottles we'll try and make some kind of distinction in a sticker or something on the label to say it was from the kickstarter so the juice won't change we won't reformulate unless we have to at some point uh, in the next batch but if you want to get in there and be one of those select people who backed me from the start it's the campaign is live and we'd love to see you pledging in there so thank you so much to everybody it really you know i'm not somebody who takes these things lightly we didn't know if we'd hit the 10 we thought we might be you know right up to the 2nd of december not quite making our target or very close we didn't know how this would go uh, but it's amazing that we've had so much support from you uh, so i will be revealing who mr wilson is he's somebody else inside the fragrance industry in the uk i'm doing most of the presentational stuff here and uh, it's very much my fragrance in terms of my conception of the kind of fragrance that I wanted to create. We went to the master perfumer, John Stephen, with the brief, spoke to him, had a little bit of back and forth. And uh, of course, I don't claim to be a perfumer or a real expert in the actual mechanics of how fragrances are created. So really the, the fantastic skill and the, the really much of the creativity has to be attributed to the great perfumer John Stephen and me really just somebody who had the concept of the kind of fragrance that we'd like to produce mixing some of the elements of my favorite fragrances a few notes that I definitely wanted in there if you like the kind of thing that you're used to seeing me quite often lean towards 
on my channel gentlemanly elegant maybe slightly old school fragrances but not mega dated a fragrance here that can be worn in the modern world we've got notes in it of bergamot mandarin lavender coriander cardamom pepper patchouli oak moss ambergris and vanilla i think i got that right uh, so it's a really really great creation it smells beautiful and I really hope some of you can smell it soon. There have been a few questions about something, so I'll very briefly try and answer those. People are saying, uh, do you offer samples or why don't you? At the moment, we don't. Just logistically, we literally only have 10 mil of this juice and the Kickstarter campaign kind of has to hit the target before we can really make much more. We are getting a few samples in, uh, like maybe 50 mil total or something that we're gonna send out to other YouTube reviewers and that kind of thing. We, we have to kind of prioritize that a bit, but there's not gonna be enough, unfortunately, for us to sell samples so that the essence of Kickstarter is that you put your faith in a project and help to bring it to fruition. So therefore, probably uh, during the lifespan of the Kickstarter, we may not be able to offer samples. We are looking into the possibility of offering them as part of the, the Kickstarter, but we'll see at the moment we don't. After that, we'll try. The other thing was shipping. We don't ship quite worldwide, but we've got shipping to the USA, Canada, the UK, a lot of countries in Europe. If you go and check out the campaign below and try and purchase, you'll find out which uh, countries are listed as an option to post to. The ones that are not, we are looking into it, so they may be added later. That We're doing everything we can. It's not as easy as you think. Thank you so much again for all the support. Let me know what you think about all of this in the comments. And of course, don't worry, my video channel is not going to be solely devoted to promoting my own brand. Uh, I will be ca carrying on with normal service and general reviews and all the usual Mr. Smelly channel stuff as usual. Uh, also, thank you to the people in the Patreon group. If you'd like to join that, again, there will be a link in the description. Uh, that's my group where you get an extra video from me every single week. Loads already uploaded. Some of these people were the first to pledge and back the project. And we have a really nice community in there and you, you find out a little bit more behind the scenes stuff about this fragrance and many more things. So I'd love to see you in there too. Thanks a lot for joining me. Remember, whatever you're doing in life, let's project. See you in the next video. Bye bye.